calls for action as European leaders prepare for a summit to try and fix the continent's fiscal woes. The summit that we are going to start tonight in Brussels is indeed a crucial one. What I expect from all heads of state and government is that they don't come saying what they cannot do, but what they will do for Europe. The head of the European Central Bank added to the uncertainty ahead of the meeting. Mario Draghi had hinted that not if governments all, agree to tighter all budget all controls, the ECB some. might step up Do its bond purchases to help follow. alleviate the crisis. But its actions on interest rates were merely a repeat of the move it made just a few weeks ago. Based on its regular economic and monetary analysis, the Governing Council decided to lower the key ECB interest rates by 25 basis points, decrease on 3rd, November 3rd, 2011. German Chancellor Angela Merkel and French President Nicolas Sarkozy will propose that European countries balance their budgets or face sanctions. Merkel and Sarkozy want to enshrine the oversight, either by changing the existing EU treaty or creating a new one for the 17 Eurozone nations that others could opt into. President Obama says leaders will need to make tough choices in order to arrive at an agreement and move beyond the crisis. If they muster the political will, they have the capacity to settle markets down, make sure that uh, they are acting responsibly, and that governments like Italy are able to finance their debt. Analysts say in order for the summit to be declared a success, the leaders would have to agree to some form of governance that keeps finances in check. Warren Levinson, Associated Press.